And good morning, good morning. It is Sunday the 8th, currently 7.35 in the morning, and we are headed off to the Fit Expo. I'm excited. I saw everyone posting pictures and like Snapchats about it yesterday, and I'm super excited to go. It looks like fun. It is gonna be me and Colin going, and it's I'm really looking forward to it. So let's catch up though. Lot, this weekend's been really, really kind of crazy and hectic and all this. Hold on, I, I, I gotta focus. Ugh, lot, lots of driving to do. I live on a dirt road and uh, ugh, there what the storms and the rain causes these massive, massive gullies down in the street and washes out some of the asphalt and all that stuff. So I have to avoid like crazy potholes and gullies and just all this shit to make sure that I don't blow a tire, break an axle, all that good stuff. Ugh. It's, it's actually a lot harder in my car than it is on my bike, which is kind of interesting. But um, let's catch up. Uh, hope I don't get hit, hope I don't get hit. Yes, uh, so this past week, I've been working on my positivity stuff and I know it's only been like two weeks, something like that, a week and a half, and um, I'm feeling better actually. I'm not all negative. I'm not worried about a whole bunch of shit really. Um, like I noticed that I just feel better throughout the day and I'm not as worried about a lot of this other crap that really used to kind of bother me. So. I would say that's going very well. All right, focus the camera on you and drive. Got it. Okay, um, so that positivity stuff has been going pretty well, um, and I encourage everybody to do that. I have been uh, also contemplating what I'm gonna do about getting out of debt, and I'm weighing my options about getting another job. Now, uh, I love training, it's absolutely awesome, but training on my own is extremely difficult and it's very hard to um, get clientele. Uh, or it's very slow, it's not hard I should say, it's slow. So, um, I'm kind of weighing my options. Do I wanna go back to, uh, do I wanna work at a box gym as well as PSP? Do I wanna get a night job somewhere? Um, I don't know. So we're kind of weighing those options, figuring out what I'm gonna do about that. So this next week we're gonna be kind of rebuilding a resume because I don't even have one anymore. And uh, kind of working on that, reaching out to some people and just see what kind of comes up. Um, and then this past weekend has been kind of crazy. On uh, Thursday, I worked out with a friend and then we hung out. I didn't get home till like probably 10, 11. And I had to be up at five or four the next day. So only a couple of, or five hours sleep, not bad. Then uh, Friday was working all day. And then me and another friend, we went out for sushi. And that, uh, kept me out kind of late too. Uh, then I didn't go to sleep for too awfully long. Then yesterday, Saturday, I got up pretty early, uh, went to work, and then was busy all day, and then uh, went out, watched some fights, some Muay Thai fights, and I saw the best fight I think I've ever seen in my life. And it was really cool to watch these two guys bang it out and really just get after it. And uh, got me really motivated and inspired because these guys were just going at it. They were gassed at the end. They were both kind of weak at the knees and they were just going for it. Um, but I had a lot of fun at those fights. Didn't get to see my friend fight, which kind of sucks, but she was like close to last on the card. And I had uh, Sean's birthday party to go to. So I went to Sean's birthday party and uh, went and had Korean barbecue. That was really good. And then, let's see. And then he and I hung out until probably one o'clock. 
So I didn't get home and in bed last night till about two and then getting up at 6.30 to get to this Fit Expo. So, whenever I'm kinda like super busy and always on the go, I get really wired actually. Like I don't have a problem with being fatigued or anything. Like I kinda feel it, but at the same time I'm just like so hyper and so excited for everything that's going down. So, it's been a lot of fun. Um, yeah, and today's the Fit Expo. I have been wanting to go for about two years, three years, something like that, and uh, I just have never been able to make it out there. So, today, the first Fit Expo I get to go to, and it's really cool. I'm repping my, can't really see it, but my Go For Broke shirt, just in case Bart and Gio are there. I doubt it, but if they're there, I'm gonna be super excited um, because I really look up to Bart for creating JK films, all that stuff, um, Barbell Brigade, all that. So, um, yeah, we'll kind of see what today brings. I've been talking for too long. So, I will check in with you guys in a little bit. Yeah. There we 
go. Very nice. So we're just cruising around the Pit Expo. I don't really want to wait in line for anything like that. And it's kind of crazy. So I'm just cruising around, seeing if I recognize anybody, enjoying the people, enjoying the views, getting inspiration from Brazen Fitness and kind of seeing what's all up there. So yeah. I'm having a blast though. I was able to meet Bart and Gio and uh, that was pretty awesome because they're huge inspirations to me and I look up to them for all their work with everything with Go For Pro, with uh, Barbell Brigade, with JK, all that. So I love watching their stuff and I love meeting them. They're just so awesome and humble. And it just epitomizes what Barbell Brigade stands for, and I love that. So, we're just kind of seeing what else is going on here. And let's kind of see. Hey, anyone recognize this guy right here? Hey, what up, Joe? What's up, bro? You chilling? Yeah, man. Have a great time? Hell yeah. inspirational because like I crashed my bike Ooh, my motorcycle and it told me I would not walk again. It told me I would never cut my leg off. Yeah. 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 So watch all the dudes at barbell and just keep it going. I just took my back. I was just dead. I got a pinch there. So I was like, man, you're going to go to the And I had to like, I dropped the weight. And then I was like, man, I suck. So I was just like, oh, I'm going to do this so bad. And I was just like, I know. They said I'm not allowed to do a whole bunch um, for up to a year after my last year. Okay. 
my last surgery was February of last year. Okay. So I still, I'm still not even supposed to be like squatting or cleaning or yeah. anything. I still do it, but, but very light. yeah. Okay. Like right now, my clean and jerk is like 225, and my snatch is like. Are you still jerking or is it like? A yeah, split jerk? No, it's good. Jerk. I don't, I don't like uh, parallel jerks at all. Yeah, it's so hard. It's super down. uncomfortable. Yeah, right. And I don't have the mobility in my lats. Yeah, I did it because I was like, oh, let's see if you feel me try it, yeah. you know? And then I, was, I just put it, I couldn't ever get it up. He yeah. also has that weird man strength. That he's it's just gifted. Like, yeah, <laughs> like especially like, it's just yeah. like, cool. Let's do one. Like seriously, I would love to do one. Yeah, just keep like, going. I'm, I'm just doing it to get my feet wet. Yeah. But, First meet, both get all white lights, right? Yeah. There we right. go. It's all gonna be Love white. It. It's gonna be like... It's kind of like Bart's first meet, where he's just like... Yeah, where he learned like... <laughs> yeah, and like five yeah. minutes before. <laughs> that was <laughs> fucking awesome. I love yeah. that. Yeah. I was like, oh, okay, good job, Bart. Yeah, it's like, yeah, cool. And then now everyone's like, oh, I'm just gonna go with you. Yeah, seriously, let's do one. Yeah, for sure. I'm hella down. It's nice awesome to meet you. you. I haven't okay. recorded the camera at us. Oh. I don't care. I do it for fun and me. Dude, best Woo. thing you ever seen What was that? It's too small, but yeah, I'll message you for sure. Oh, yeah. You want to see yourself? Alright, cool. Pose. Yeah. It was awesome to meet you, Ren. Get it. The 357 of the day. We took an already great lineup and made it even better. All right, what is up, guys? We are fast forwarding past a lot of time. Um, finished up at the expo, ended up heading home. Colin and I worked a lot on uh, behind the scenes stuff that I can't really go into right now, but it's it's gonna be really cool. Really looking forward to it. Um, then I got home, realized I hadn't really eaten all day besides my breakfast, and uh, then ordered a pizza, ate my pizza, and now I'm feeling good. I hope you guys enjoyed all the footage from the expo. As of this point, right now, I have not seen any of this, but by the time you're watching this, I have seen it and I've edited it, so. Uh, weird timey-wimey space-time stuff, which we won't get into, but I hope it turned out okay, and I hope you guys enjoyed it and had fun. I really did. I spent a lot of the expo um, enjoying it. I didn't really film a whole bunch of uh, like what I was actually doing or anything like that, just because I was enjoying the moment, and I feel like that's really important to kind of, not necessarily, un oh yeah, unplug. Um, not worry about your phone, not worry about stuff, just live life in the moment. And I really had fun doing that this weekend and today. So, yeah, hope everyone had a great time. Oh, before I forget, uh, I actually had fun. I'd really talk, as you guys probably saw, I was able to talk to Bren, one of the guys from Barbell Brigade. And um, we talked about actually doing a weightlifting competition. And Ren, if you're watching this, I'm looking forward to that. I'm excited for it. And I'm going to see what I can do and make happen because I'm really looking forward to that. Maybe I'll even hop into Barbell and train with you. So, yeah, if you made it this far, thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, all that good stuff. And then I will check in with you next time.